Hey everybody, Christopher Rod here, welcome back. This is XCOM 2, small little indie game just released. And uh, this is Operation Firewheel. Uh, basic enemies, there's a sectopod, yeah, okay. Uh, Muton Elites, Archer, Mech Archers, Sidewinders, and Elite Troopers. We take out Walker, Moreau, Sari, Corpal, Fournier, and Carter. Let's rock and roll. Uh, two really quick announcements as we go in here. Number one, somebody edited like basically a 90 minute movie slash highlight clip of season one XCOM 2 and sent deploy. it to me. <laughs> it's like, it's so, it's pretty funny to go back and like watch some of this stuff. Uh, so I'll probably put that on the channel and I think it'll be interesting. Um, if you guys have like, if you guys have made, I, this is not the first time somebody's done something like this, but if you guys have uh, videos or like highlight things that you think other people would enjoy, using any of the previous XCOM campaigns, uh, let me know, get in touch with me, and uh, if it's cool, I'll put it on the channel and we'll show everybody, it'd be fun. Uh, second thing is, uh, I recently did like a sock campaign where people could buy socks with my little logo dude on there. Sorry Bradford, I'll pause. They're asking for our help in ensuring the target is dealt with, so we're moving in to secure the area. Neutralize all hostile forces standing in your way. If possible, capture the VIP alive. If all else fails, take them out. Well, we're gonna take them alive if we can. Uh, the overwhelming, the overwhelming feedback that I got during that uh, campaign, I call it campaign, I don't know why, because it's a very limited time that I do these things. Anyways, was, hey, if there's ever a t-shirt or if there's ever a hoodie, like, that's what I really want. I don't really want socks. And I'm like, okay, I get it. So uh, we finally did it. We have a really cool design. Uh, there might be a little annotation or a little, it's called cards, something with an I in the top right that shows up Menace where you can five, uh, check out the store and if you're engage. interested in a shirt or a hoodie, then go for it. Contact. Hashtag sellout. Hashtag sellout. The squad is concealed. Alright, cool. Let's get into it, Priya, shall we? Feeling pretty good. Uh, feeling pretty good. I'm gonna send Priya right out there. Moving. Be a man. Or, you know, whatever. Uh, Fournier. Head on down. Walker, this is like Easier an exceptional little sniper perch. Uh, oh, it looks like we had action right there. I'm gonna swing Carter out to the right. Oh shit, I've just made a huge mistake. No, we're good, we're good. <laughs> that, uh, that is real tempting. That is real tempting. Okay, Moreau. Let's bring you down here. And lastly, definitely not least, I think sorry I'm gonna bring all the way around to the right side. I'll actually bring up uh, the chef a little bit. Priya, we'll keep you back here so we can keep you concealed if possible. Let's get the recon on these guys Got a hostile target in range. while we can. And then let's do a uh, steady weapon up here. Don't go too far. Yeah, right there is good. All right, I'm doing it. Laying down a monster kill zone. They're probably just gonna Overwatch anyways, but it's fine. <laughs> uh, let's bring Carter up. Ugh, it's not quite far enough. We could shred storm. Do you have anybody else? We do have Sari, I guess we could use her. Uh, we have tons of other explosives. And this this will force us to get Sari a little bit more involved. Right behind ya! Wake up! might not even need the kill zone. I'm now realizing. 
All right. On the move. Check out the minivan. Okay, hi there. Hi there, hello there. Uh I kinda we kinda need to wait here now. Scanning. Overwatch. If we don't want to reveal that sectopod. Oh that one damage could be the difference maker. Nice shot. Oh, come on now. Pretty strong, these elites. Missed. Oh, and the rage suit panic. Yeah, shoot your buddies. Oh, yeah, even better. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. That's outstanding. Uh, <laughs> it's pretty good. What am I shooting here? It's the sectopod. I'm going for it. I don't know how we see it. I'm not going to argue it. Taking full advantage. Again. Look how much damage you did to the elites, too. Oh, you know who's happy to see this? It's Carter. Uh... Uh, maybe not. The cone's not that great. I do like this option, though. Fire it's gonna do some work. And the crits on the one with full health, too. Now, we don't have any, like, really good domination targets. So probably hold off. 54 to shut him down. We just attack him. Do we have blue screens? No. Do we have blue screens here? Absolutely. Ah, uh, we could get in there. Is that gonna, is that gonna cause a problem? I kinda like this, but I kinda like having the stasis as well, just in case something bad happens. Let's see what you can get done. Takes him down to 13. Maybe what we do is we shadow fall this one, retain the concealment. Let's actually, let's do it from here. To designated position. Gives us a little bit more forward vision, so if we want to use the Rage Strike, we can. A little bit safer. I definitely got that one. Nice, promoted. 
I'm hoping she doesn't blow up the car here, though. That's... It is a concern that I should have probably thought about more. Nope, car is completely intact. Come on, I believe in you. Oh! Feels good, man. Feels good. Put him down. That was an exceptional turn of events right there. Absolutely. Okay, now, do you have... You don't have Fortress yet. Do you? No. Okay, let me bring up Priya over on the right side. Still concealed. We see our target inside. Move in a little closer. Do you have eyes on anything? Not quite. Most likely she's not going to be alone. I'm going... Let's just bring everybody up. Yes, I'll do the recon. Got it, moving. And Walker, I could always just Icarus you in there whenever I need to, but let's bring that you down here now. It gives you eyes on the uh, on the VIP. Come get some. I hear some scurrying. Moving on target location. Nothing. Really? Okay. I can handle that. She's so pleasant. On my way. VIP located. Target identity. And then you have confirmed. sorry. Or, uh, Corpal. Move out. The joke is that these guys are like sisters, right? Move but they couldn't position. be more different. So I was like, yeah, I'll totally do that for you. Corpal's like, uh, maybe if you ask nicely. And even still questionable. I'm on the Oh, yes. Come on. Oh, you're gonna regret this, heavy mech. Or not. Maybe you won't regret this. Yes, you will. Oh, spoke too soon. Enemy is still up. I got eyes on an absent position. Negative damage. Nice shot. Nice shot. Hostile target down. We're gonna go double tap on that mech, you know it. Oh, he can't see him, hey? Isn't that too bad? What would we do without Walker? Okay, here's the thing about Walker, and like, I hope this doesn't offend anybody, but you know how like, um, you know how Loxley was like the sniper, or like Grelite from season one of like regular XCOM? Uh, I feel like Walker is like underappreciated by both myself and everybody else. I'm I just feel you. like he needs more recognition. More praise. That's my thought, anyways. Okay, how am I supposed to get in here? Orders confirmed. On the move. Let's just see if there's anything else around. I guess we'll just break in. That's the answer to that Let's question. Move. On the move. Say. On Overwatch. Coming. Moving to Overwatch. Scanning. 
I'm sure we still... Yeah, okay, there we go. I was gonna say, I'm sure we still have action out here. Oh, they're going up top. Really? Is he alone? I'm sure he's got company behind him. Oh, nice shot. Yeah, he's got an elite. There's an elite back there. Repeat, elite the back. Shot wide. Okay, this calls for an explosion. Do we have anything that can take out the floors? Yeah, this will do. I actually don't know if this is going to hit. If I pull back a bit, we can spread that cone a little wider. Eh, uh, I may still only get the muton. That's fine. Gather around. Oh, he had a grenade. We could use that. It's fine. We'll use him to kind of weaken them a little bit. Blow out the rest of this cover, hopefully. This VIP is like, what the hell have I gotten into? And how do I get out of it? Let's go for the crits. Oh my god, yes. Walker, see? Great job, Walker. Keep it up. You're an amazing person. I should probably just soul fire there, to be honest. But I didn't. Stay out of sight. Mmm, very nice. Okay, now I do want to get in there. Yeah. Uh... Stick to the shadows. Yeah, we'll do it. Okay, Fournier, you can do it. Be careful. Target package in custody. Oh well, hello. We're clear. Hit the trail. Everybody, to the evac point, we'll please. Do. Thank you. Moving out. Watch us figure out a way to blow up that vehicle right next to everybody. No need to ask twice. Oh, nice. Menace one five, we're picking up an enemy transport inbound on your current position. That's fine. Uh, that's fine, right? Let's bring Fournier in here under angle. the statue, or under the car on display, I should say. <laughs> Not necessarily a statue. I'm going. I'm gonna bring these guys up a little closer. Sure thing. Closing on target position. I now. want Priya to get revealed here. Grab some more heavy amps. Do think you can win this, huh? And then let's bring Penda. Carter up. And we're gonna drop in a little uh, pre-acid surprise here. Heads down. Not necessarily pre-acid. It's full-on acid. 
Oh crap, the trooper is in the back there. On Overwatch. Let's see how they like this approach. It's nice when you have a mission go super smoothly, not to jinx it. And you just get to kind of mess around with the advent a little bit. Like, that's the best feeling in the world, honestly. I got eyes on advent troops. Oh, so the pre-acid does nothing, but they don't move. So that's this, that's this weird thing. We've seen this happen with, like, I think it was a sectopod in the past where it, like, didn't move because anywhere it would go, it would take damage. So, yeah. Uh, Void Rift or Flamethrower? Void Rift. Welcome it's too cool. Sanity checks, let's go. It's probably not right kill. Yep. That's how it's done. So good. Poor pal, this is all you. Hit Almost. The armor. Eyes on you. Sorry, you want this? Take that as a yes. You know that was good. That was good. Seems doable. Okay, let's get this group out. <laughs> Almost forgot that we have a turn counter. I'm just like partying here. This is Firebrand. VIP is secure. <gasps> oh shit. Oh, no, good. <laughs> I was like, oh, man, did we just evac and now we're standing there out in the open? If we evac um, Moreau is the question. Uh, can I get you up here at all? It's not looking good. Where can I put you to commemorate this occasion? Just go up top. Gonna null land some vehicles, even though it's not gonna do anything, just for looks. Just get rid of that extra energy before we head home, you know. Just in time. I'm gone. Okay, good job, squad. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. That went well. Way better than you could ever hope, you know. Okay, there we go. I realized on yesterday's mission, I forgot to cut this part out. <laughs> so it was like literally just like silence. Probably hear me like messing around, like waiting for it to finish. Sorry, I'm gonna try and cut those out every time because the loading time with all these mods for whatever reason is just insane. I'm already thinking about season five and I'm like, oh, do I want to do mods again? Do I want to go vanilla? I don't know. The aliens must be getting nervous by now. It's really tough. It's a really tough decision. Okay, here we go. Priya. Still getting promotions. Battle focus. Build one focus each turn. Focus adds one mobility. Max of five. Also adds grand finale. Oh, grand finale was cool. Consumed up to five points of focus. Steal one to five bonus damage in one shot. That's pretty cool. It's like a guarantee, right? And then she can, like, cruise all over the map. Rush of battle. Build adrenaline when enemies die. Each point adds five true dodge. Meh. What about cool off, though? Consume up to six points of adrenaline to heal 15%, missing HP per point. Oh, wow. So, maximum we could heal 90% health? That's pretty outstanding. Problem is that we don't really use her like that. She doesn't really take damage. 
Collect one intelligence each turn. Intelligence provides one offense and defense to all allies. Max of five. Also adds the move out ability. Spend five intelligence to fully restore one ally's action points up to two. That, that is cool. So after five turns, you can re it's basically like having a free... Like if you use this on somebody with rapid fire, or not rapid fire, um, the thing where you can shoot twice. You can have that person shoot four times because you can restore two action points. That's cool. Yes, please. Plus, you get the uh, the extra offense and defense to everybody. It's five, but it's, you know, it's five. Five percent. That's cool. I like. Excellent work, Commander. Your efforts continue to bolster the resistance movement across the globe. Now, I don't say I want to trigger the Avenger defense, but I kind of want to trigger the Avenger defense. You know? I should also start working on... I should try and make contact everywhere if I can. Uh, so we've got lock and load. We've got fire when ready. We've got all in. What are we missing? Oh, here. You know, I could just go with the intel that we have. I could just go straight there. That We still have 200 intel left over. I'm thinking about the network tower mission though. And that, we can buy some bonuses. They're about 30 each, so we need about 120 to 150. This would still be more than enough, I think. I'm gonna, oh, we are actually at maximum capacity. Hold on. Let's upgrade one of these bad boys. It's not like we need the money. Oh, we don't even need to. Look at, we have a million engineers just chilling. I think I will just go... Oh, Chili needs it too. Okay, well this is 80, so let's start here. Setting course for the Chilean Control District. Chilean Control District. I don't think we've ever taken Chili, because I don't recall her ever saying Attempting to establish local regional contact. Okay, Carmine is back. Central. Oh god. Commander, excellent. My analysis of the fragmented codex data is almost complete. The information I've uncovered so far outweighs the loss of the Shadow Chamber, as you'll see. Is that... an elder? Haven't seen one in at least a decade. Yes, and I believe I now understand why. The elders appear to be afflicted with an aggressive form of tissue degeneration, rapid muscular atrophy, to a degree I had not even thought possible. So they're dying. Sounds like our job just got a whole lot easier. As with most things involving this adversary, it's never quite that simple. The elders have been aggressively searching for a cure to their condition for centuries. Each time they encountered a new species, they procured what genetic information and material they required and moved on to the next world. Until now. I believe they found something in us. Something important enough to cause them to take root. A cure? Not that I can determine. Several key files were previously deleted as part of something called the Avatar Directive. Avatar. We need those files. Were I to gain access to a fully functioning codex, I might be able to recover them. Or blow the entire ship to hell this time around. I didn't say I needed the creature here, Bradford. I am confident I could access the unit remotely, provided your soldiers can get close enough to it in the field without destroying it first. That we can arrange, Doctor. New objective added. Okay, new objective added. Skulljack on a codex. Easier said Commander, than done, of course. I've updated our current objectives based on the most recent findings. Okay. Uh, yes, Commander. I don't really need to do any of these. That's right, we still have... We can still pump out intel 
So that's really not a worry at all. Um, I'm gonna finish off the other autopsies just because. Despite Shin's reservation. Our next objective is skulljacking a codex, so we'll do that. Nice, there's Fortress on Anderson. Bastion. Fortress now provides immunity to nearby teammates. That's cool. Had no idea that that was ever a thing. I've never seen it before. That's awesome. I don't think I've ever seen Bastion before. Even when I was doing those preview videos making the, uh, the PsyOps one, I don't think I saw that. That's cool. We're reading you. Okay, so there's Chili. Uh, we do need to put up... Oh, hold on. This could actually... Oh, this could work out perfectly. Let's put up a um, radio relay here, because we need that to get the bonus. We're just being interrupted. Uh, what do we got here? Gorilla Ops, hack the hidden resistance computer. Dr. Christian Kelly is a scientist. Um, hidden event, or... Detection radius for supplies. We really don't need a scientist, but we really don't need supplies either. Let's go with this one. It's it's a more difficult mission. Um, hacker resistant computer, and we know there's going to be codexes. It's going to be a little bit more action, plus a gatekeeper, plus a hive queen. So it'll up Science the difficulty a little bit. Indonesian zone. I'm not intentionally dodging that Avenger defense either. I think that would be really fun to try with these guys. Okay. So if we need to do some hacking, let's bring Carmine. We'll load her out in a second. Obviously, Walker comes on every mission. I wouldn't mind trying our new ability that we just got with Corpal. Uh, Anderson. She just got Fortress, right? In her long list of abilities. Solace, Void Rift. Isn't this insane? Yeah, Fortress. Okay, so you're in. Do we have enough classes to do like an all? No, we don't. But we could definitely try like a two class mission or something. Like where it's only ranger. We could do rangers and shinobis. That would be pretty close to being basically the same thing. Actually, that's not true. The rangers are more uh, shooty shooty. We could do assaults and shinobis. That's what we could do. Hmm. I'll think about that. That could be fun. Could also be devastating. Uh, let's see. Let's bring Locke. So, we got our specialist for the hacking. Actually, you know what? With the improved range, we should probably use Corpal for the hacking. Or for the, uh, skulljacking of the Codex, you know? I think so. And then let's bring, uh, let's bring a Grenadier. You know who hasn't seen action for a while? Let's bring Mr. Batch. This could go well. I'm sure. Alright, Corpal. Instead of that flashbang. Let's go with the Skulljack. Oops. Carmine, take the med kit, please. Uh, let's go with the... What do we want for you? Why don't you take the venom rounds, actually? Do you want the superior stock on you? For now, at least. Okay, so Walker's already set up. 
Let's hook up Anderson here with the exosuit. We'll go scope and stock. And we could do... We could do talent rounds, I guess. I don't really like that. Does Locke have rapid fire? No. Set you up in the rage suit. Let's go Shredstorm Cannon. Actually, let's give Shredstorm somebody else. Do you take the blaster launcher? And then grab a set of blue screens. Batch, I'm gonna put you in the war suit. Give you the last stock. You take the shred storm. Take acid bombs here. And you know, with that Chris with that big chrysalid thing. I'm going to take the incendiary bomb, actually. And then with Carmine, we could give you the serpent armor. Oh, uh, that actually limits your slots. That's true. But does it really matter? Do we really care about the venom rounds? Not really. I think this is fine-ish. I think it's okay. Is there anything else we can upgrade before we go out? I've been sitting on this Gremlin Mark III upgrade for a while. We're, what we're saving for is to get this scram gun. I need 60 Illyrium, but it's just taking forever. I said I would buy it, so I'm gonna I'm gonna wait. But it's Taking a lot of willpower. Okay, Carmine Walker, Corpal, Anderson Locke, and Mr. Batch himself. Wish me luck. We'll see you soon, guys. Bye bye. The world you once knew is no more. Earth is now ruled by the Advent Coalition and their alien masters. 